Of all the businesses out there, which type do you choose? One of the reasons I consider a direct selling business a perfect business is very simply because the company will work with you to get the business skills that make you rich. Always remember that it's not money that makes you rich, it's business skills. And that's why it's a perfect business. They'll, work, they'll take as long as you like to get the skills to make the money. And that's a lifetime skill thing. The other part about it is the low startup cost. You know, where else can you get in for under $500 and get these skills? For people who want to make the shift over to the B quadrant, which is what I would recommend for people, one of the beauties of a network marketing company is that you can do that for a very low price. And that's why I talk to people about considering network marketing. If you're to build a Microsoft, it would take you hundreds of millions of dollars. But a network marketing company allows you to start at a very low rate. They'll be patient with you. They'll take their time to transition over here. And the reason why that time is so important to most people is it takes time to change those values. And the most important thing is once you take the time, let's say it takes one year, two years, five years, whatever time it takes, once you see the, the value or the core values of this side and this side, you're unstoppable. Today, I would never go back and get a job. Why should I? I'd rather stay on this side, build companies, pay less taxes, and make more money. But the key is a person needs to change the values from my poor dad to the values of my rich dad. And that's one of the views of network marketing companies. They allow you the time, and at very low cost, they'll work with you to make that transition over there. The number one asset a person can build is build a business. That is the smartest thing you can do. You've been told the corporate ladder is the surest route to your success. Years ago, I decided not to follow the corporate ladder simply because, again, it was values. You know, my poor dad always said, go to school and get a high paying job with the government or big corporation. But my rich dad said, why would you work so hard at something you'll never own? You can't sell your job. You can't pass it on to your kids. So to me, it never made any sense. It made more sense to build my own business and hire other people. The other reason is that you really don't have much control if you're in the corporate ladder world. For example, you can get fired at any time, or today we have what's called M&As or mergers and acquisitions where another company buys another company. So you could be a great employee, but the company that buys your company just fires you. Wait a minute. This sounds too good to be true. Like one of those get-rich-quick schemes. It's not a get-rich-quick formula. You don't just do it overnight. It takes time. I still remember the first time I made that transition was back in 1978 when I fully quit my job and I had to depend upon my company that I was building to support me. So I understand the fear. The beauty, the most important thing to remember is this. There's two kinds of people in the world. There are the types that will say, you'll never make it. And there was a lot of, I had a lot of people, a lot of friends and family saying that. You're stupid. Don't do it. And the second type were the people that said, go for it. You can do it. Don't worry about it. We'll cover you. So the most important thing is support of friends and family. One of the beauties of a direct selling company is that they provide that personal support to you for as long as it takes you to make the journey from the left side to my rich dad side. You always thought being self-employed was living the American dream. One of the challenges of being self-employed is that you're your own boss. You're the solo act. Like in the S quadrant, you're the individual. You do it on your own. Whereas in the B quadrant, you're a team player. You have to depend upon your team and come to your team. So the problem with being an S is that, let's say you're in a traffic accident, there goes your income. And let's say you get older and you haven't set enough money aside to retire on, that means you'll probably have to work for the rest of your life because you don't have anybody else to fall back on, not a team to count on. So one of the problems with the S, all the most people say is the most satisfying of all work, it is a solo act and you're totally on your own. Personally, I'd rather be a member of a team if they can count on me and I can count on them. It sounds like a smart move, but change, it's so difficult. We all know the world has changed, but sometimes the hardest thing to change is ourselves. And being an old guy, I sort of know the older I get, I sometimes get more set in my ways. 
And I think that's one of the things that a direct selling business offers people, why it's the perfect business. They allow you to take your time to make the mental, emotional, and physical changes required to move from the left side to the rich dad side. I think that's a big thing. It's a very gracious, it's a very elegant way, it's a patient way of supporting you in making the changes of your life. So please remember, change always creates upset, but sometimes we all know we have to make those changes. And if you know it's time for you to make that change, then the perfect business may be a direct selling business for you. Direct selling. It is quite possibly the perfect business for you. For more information, contact the person who gave you this video.